YouTube's got a serious business model problem with their advertising formula, okay? And I only know, I can only view it from my perspective. I don't know what your perspective is. For me, apparently they have figured out that I go to Tractor Supply for whatever reason, probably because I made a YouTube video describing how ridiculous the Tractor Supply reward system is and YouTube thought, hey, this guy must just love Tractor Supply. So what they've done is every time I'm watching my favorite video or I'm listening to my favorite album on YouTube, they will constantly interrupt it with a tractor supply video. Now, is that, let me ask you a question. Is that helping tractor supply? It is getting tractor supply on my mind, but I'm ready to never walk through the doors of tractor supply again, because not because of anything tractor supply is doing, because YouTube is wearing me out on tractor supply. I mean, there's, there's obviously an advertising algorithm problem in uh, the, the, the genius company called YouTube. And YouTube gets more pathetic every year in the amount of advertising. I, I mean, it's gotten to the point where I'm never going to buy a GMC for the sole reason that they interrupt my videos too much. I get... I get trained, I get it's a mental response, it's a trigger. I am angry with GMC, why? Because every time I'm watching a video, their stupid commercial, oh, in uncertain times, GMC will allow you to buy a vehicle with payment relief from the comfort of your own home. I'm so sick of this. Am I the only one that thinks YouTube has some serious advertising problems where this is going to backfire on the people that are paying for the ads. Let me know. Let me know. This is very annoying. Thank you.